What's up, tutorial heads? So, uh, today I want to talk about something that uh, I've been in the closet about for years, like since I can remember. Uh, I'll just come out and say it. I have schizophrenia. Um, yeah, I was in the closet about it. I just recently started like telling people, started telling my friends like that I haven't told before. You know, and n nobody really understands it, but like there's positive symptoms and negative symptoms. And the positive symptoms are like delusions and hallucinations and hearing voices. And uh, my meds manage those pretty well. Like I don't uh, really hear voices anymore or have delusions or anything like that. I just have like the negative symptoms, like really hardcore all the time almost. So yeah, I always thought it was like, uh, not schizophrenia. Like I was always in denial about it. Like I would say, oh, you know, I, I just, I, I can't draw right now because I just have art block or, you know, I just don't want to talk to people because I'm depressed or whatever, you know, it's just depression or it's just whatever, you know, it's anything but schizophrenia, but it's literally like to the letter, like textbook schizophrenia is uh like the root of all my problems really and like i try to work a couple jobs and i would just like i would be a cook like at a burger joint and i would just be making burgers or whatever and the screen would turn into like it would go from like making sense to after a while just turning into like random letters and numbers that didn't mean anything and I couldn't like continue to make burgers so like I lost the job obviously so uh just stuff like that and uh yeah when I watch videos like uh or if I hear someone talking about it like there's like videos on YouTube of doctors describing schizophrenia like uh psychiatrists or psychologists describing it and uh they list every single symptom and every single symptom in great detail and they describe it and i feel like when they describe it like i'm being called out personally like on every single one it's crazy um but exercise helps you know like lifting cardio it helps uh another thing that helps is talking to people and like having a social network so like I'm constantly texting my family and constantly texting people and you know talking to people on the phone or whatever and you know I'll visit I'll visit my parents house like a lot as well and you know just do work around the farm or whatever that also helps uh like there's ups and downs like I'll have some days where I'll just there, I've had days where I would just draw all day nonstop, like doing requests or whatever. And then there's days where I just can't like pick up the pen. Like I'll have people asking me to draw and I just, or I'll just have something, I'll have something I really want to draw really bad and I just can't pick up the fucking pen. Like I just can't do it. Uh, and uh, like instead I'll just sit there in a room like staring at a screen with nothing on it. Just kind of doing nothing just kind of waiting for the answers to come, I guess. Uh, yeah, I was always in denial. I was always in denial. Like, even though I'd been diagnosed in 2012, I, I was always in denial. Like, oh, no, it's, it's not schizophrenia, you know? It's, it's just schizophrenia, you know? It's not, that's not my problem. That's not, it's just a minor thing. <laughs> no, it's just a minor thing, fucking, that's not the issue here. But, uh, no, I'm gonna try to get a therapist soon. Like, uh, like a psychologist like to give me more tools and stuff to help with it because like it's it's really crippling like especially as someone who's trying to be an artist and it's like you know in order to get good you have to practice but like when you can't pick up the pen for days at a time it's really like crippling uh and uh, the last thing is like <laughs> When I see YouTube videos and it's like Asmongold or whatever and he's just talking about whatever, just talking about something, can be anything, just talking for like 20, 30 minutes straight about this thing, just nonstop talking about it. Like how the fuck does anyone 
talk about something for 20 minutes straight like that's just unfathomable to me i could never do that i can't talk for something like without like here i have a fucking piece of paper with what i was supposed to say like written down like that <laughs> how the fuck you know it's just unfathomable but yeah that's pretty much it and uh you guys be well stay safe Peace out.